I felt great about it. Uh, obviously, I did it. Uh, <laughs> but at the end of the day, uh, no, there was no fallout. I mean, <clears throat> people don't realize that, you know, how strikes and can really swing at bats one way or another. And I, I just felt like, you know, there was a lot of other things I'm not going to go into at the moment. I'm going to wait to see when I get my piece of paper from MLB, and then I'll be as vocal as I want to about the certain individual that this was about. Um, but I'm going to wait into that moment and just to kind of see where this is, where, where it goes. But at the end of the day, 1-1 one, one counts are probably the biggest count in all of Major League Baseball. I mean, you can go look it up on your statistics, and I mean, I can pull it up like sure. instantly right now. I mean, a 1-1, one, one, you know, 1-1 one, one count, you have 334 Major League average batting average. You have 534 slugging, 837 OPS, which is, you know, quite good. That pitch that gets called a strike, that's a ball. Uh, now you go to a one-two count. The expected batting average, major league average, is 165 on base, 172 slugging, 249 OPS, 422. So I mean, you want to start getting into statistics and analytics. Well, guess what? When those pitches go my way or the uh, pitcher's way or whatever that may be, umpire con consistently isn't doing their job correctly. You know, that's affecting our careers. That's affecting our success. At the end of the day, there's no reprimand, no accountability for the guys that are making the decisions. Yeah. Matter of fact, they don't care. They don't care at all, most of them. Uh, they just want to get the game over with for the most part. And it's pretty sad because, you, you know, Guys are making six figures a year, and there's no accountability. Hey, I want to know where you have the pitch. And I asked him three times, very clear, and he couldn't answer my question. And when Rocco came out and, you know, hit, hit the umpire's, you know, explanation was, oh, I think he's just getting excited. No, I'm not getting excited. I'm asking you a question. And you can't answer my question. And then now you're trying to revert the attention back to me like I'm being – and I'm not. I'm just asking you a question. And you can't answer it. And at the end of the day, it gets reflected towards me. And so after that was kind of like how it was banned, it was wrapped back around – and I saw him right by, right by home plate, and, like, he was, you know, he was wanting me to do something. And so I gave it to him. And so, you know, I, I made it a point, you know, the players are the only ones that can hold these guys accountable um, because there's no institute of fines. There's no institution of suspensions for these guys. They just go out here, show up every day, you know, show up at, you know, 6 o'clock and then – they're out of here 30 minutes after the game. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter to them. You know, they're, they don't realize that we're playing for our families. We're playing for our livelihood. And, you know, fortunately for me, I have a contract. But at the same time, I want to win and I, and I compete. But for a lot of these guys who do not, you know, the difference between consistently bad uh, calls against one individual can definitely uh, affect their career one way or another. No. So do you feel like you accomplished what you were trying to accomplish, crossing home plate, or do you think you could have done that without? No, I think I pretty much summed it up. I think I nailed it, actually, because uh, all of you guys, and I heard, Justin, that you had a lot of people texting you and saying that they were embarrassed. Well, I'm not. Like, this is my livelihood. You know, this is part of – you know, what makes me the player that I am. And, and at the end of the day, if I have something on my chest, and that's just going to be what it is. And if I, and I, as I said, you kind of just came in here earlier that um, there will be other things. I just want to kind of see where this goes. First off, how MLB is going to play it. And then I'll come out with further things along. Um, 
so it's just there was more things to it than just that one particular moment. It wasn't, oh, hey, he called a 2-0 pitch a strike on me, and now I'm going to kick dirt on home plate as I cross home plate after a home run. That wasn't my intention. Uh, there was a lot of things that kind of boiled up to that situation to where I was like, look, if he really wants this attention, I'll give it to him. 